You survived. For better or worse, I know not. The house is in ruins, the eldest lie butchered, and Bizarain has betrayed us to the Tawatha. He must be denied. For our honoured sorrow, our broken pride, our due vengeance. He cannot be allowed to use the house for war. He is at the birthplace of summer and winter, where the Weeping King first pooled the anguish and decay inherent in all winter fay, Ashara. It is the plain from which all fae descend when they are reborn, and to which they return when they die. It is a place of pure magic. I fear you may have had enough of secrets, but here is mine. I am the Weeping King Reborn. Bizarre needed a key to reach the sorrows. I do not. I, I do not know what will happen if I attempt to bring you into Ashara, but you have a strong will. That alone may save you. Bizarrain has a head start on us. However short, it is likely still enough. Be on your guard. We must hurry. You. You have a strong force of will. Stronger than I felt possible. I have never heard tell of a mortal that could stand in Ashara. But we are here. I... I can recall now. Vaguely. I walked this place before. And shaped the ground. That tree in the center. It is the embodiment of the sorrows. Bizarrain will be there. But he has prepared himself. This barrier keeps us from him. And there are other magics at work. You may be right, mortal. If we strike at weak points, the barrier will fall. Now let us go. We must hurry. We... we meet again, mortal. Can I... can I truly be here? Standing before the sorrows? I remember... no... no swords. Fire. And then... and then... Nothing. But he brought me back to fight you. I cannot... Res I can't. I'm sorry, mortal. So, so sorry. Must be quick.
We must be quick. You! You dare tread here. A mortal dare shows himself in the sacred lands of the House of Sorrows. I have been dead a short time, and already I learned so much since he raised me. You are the cause of all this. Bizarrain relied on you for his plans. Because of you, the house is dead. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, you have come. I must admit, I did not give you credit when last we faced each other. And now, I am here. My master has raised me to protect his labors, and I will oblige him. You may have bested me previously, but you will not do so again. Perhaps if I take your head here, my master will have faith in me once again. Shall we find out? And so you have finally reached me. I have waited, mortal. The longest of any I have waited. And now, Bizarrain has raised me against my will to be part of his design. I sought to stop him. I found the plan he had conspired, and I fled the house, for I knew not what to do. But I could have stopped this scheme. And then you came and killed me. And now I am a puppet to his will. He cannot be stopped, mortal. Bizarrain cannot be stopped. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
must be quick. You have slain what vestiges of your past I could conjure, and the barrier has fallen. So now, we are here. You think your presence here can stay my spells? The last words have been uttered. You are too late to stop me. I might ask the same question, but in truth, I do not care. Face me. be dead, but the death blow is still his. The sorrows have already begun escaping their seal. We need to act quickly, or this will all be for nothing. I must seal the sorrows within myself. I... I do not know for sure. 
I will be forced to remain in Ashara lest the sorrows break free once more. Whether I will live or die is unclear. But, but I cannot be afraid. It must be done. For the good of mortals. For the good of Fae. I... It is a noble sentiment, mortal. But you do not understand. They must be anchored in Ashara, and you cannot remain here. Only I can. But please, bear witness to this last act. Tell the world what happened here. How the House of Sorrows ended. We must hurry. Lirius, looking to restock. Ilan Doldran has what you need. Come back again. Child of dust is here for death. Yeah. <laughs> 
The undying mortal from the well has returned. Your mere existence is an abomination against all things. How can you not see this? Mortals pervert the world, twisting it to their own ends. Your unnatural new life is only the latest in a long line of your kind's debaucheries. But Tiernor, the merciful, chose me to be the cure. My army is the wildfire that will clear the land of you and your kind. struggle against the force of a simple army. How will you fare, I wonder, against the power of a god? Only a fool denies the power they can feel. She's been speaking more and more, and she has such interesting things to say about you. Soon. Tiernoch the Merciful will come to our world in person. Then we'll see whose life is a lie, and whose life is nothing but salt and cinders. Mm. 
Have ye come to die? I've never killed a mortal. <laughs> See mortal. <laughs> A mortal dares to stand against Tiernock. To strike him down and stop the earth on his grave. Yeah. Nothing may live. Listen to him, I'm coming to him. Life will carry on when you are dust. As you might. Struggle as you will, you are deluded. There is no winning for you, only death. Yes, but death as you define it means little to us. The great cycle returns each to offer as to offer again. And every time they do, Tiernok gets stronger. Soon, she will be born into this world. You will witness her power personally, and it will be the last thing your mortal flesh shall ever feel. change in the land. Gadflo's voice has fallen silent in this land. The Tuatha are frightened and disorganized. They run back to Alabastra to make their final stand. We owe you much. Our eyes are opened and our blades unsheathed. Cluricon is won, but the House of Pride stands between us and the final goal. We are now free to press forward. And I can take you to an old friend who knows the next step. Yes, we will take you to his filthy tower on the island of Danistar. He hides within and has not emerged in some time. I would like nothing more than to let him rot there. But he knows of a way past the Sentinel of the House of Pride. But there will be more danger on the path ahead. Take these blades to prepare for whatever troubles you will face at his tower or beyond. Far to the southwest, there is a darkened tree by the Caled coast. Meet me there, and we can walk the shadow to the gnome's tower. Aelin Shear will be waiting there. 
She was most insistent to join in whatever business you have with the Collector of the Dead. We will meet again at the Shadowed Tree on the Calet Coast.